Welcome back, my friends. My name is Eric. This is Rome. And uh, we got a camera here somewhere. There we go. Welcome back. Uh, I can't really move any closer, unfortunately, because I've got a dog. Oh, he moved. His head was, like, actually under the wheels, more or less. So I couldn't go anywhere except where I was. Alrighty. Now that, now that poor Buddha's moved his head out of the way, out of, out of danger, we're back. Um... Yeah. Did, did I miss anything last time? Let's see. We had the trial. We're with Wolf's Dragoons. We're here to defend Kirita. The Kiritan throne. Yeah, we're at the world. Ah, there we go. Uh, I don't think I have anything else to do. We do have a new pilot. We're going to have Samantha. Um, anybody have any XP to spend? Uh, I mean, I guess we could put it there, but let's, let's go ahead and put it towards evasion. We don't do very much melee combat. Um, 2,400 again. Yeah, not much for Jaden. And... Again, we could put one there. But that's it for Yuchi. Uh, alright. So, facilities. What do we got going on right now? Um, we've got a handful of mechs. We've got 475. So we've got, uh, Yuichi's still in Mia's Executioner. Uh, J uh, Samantha is in my executioner. I am still in the Warhawk. Uh, oh, maybe not still, but I am in the Warhawk with four ER PPCs. Uh, we've got the Dire Wolf with the Gauss, three large pulse, and two streaks. And we've got this one. Is this what I want? Hmm. Hold on. What, what's my tonnage? Is that why I'm in this one? I did actually play or attempt this mission once already, but not trying to record it or anything. I was just, I was just bored. And I thought I'd do it. I didn't want to record, but I wanted to play some. So we get 500 tons. So we can go bigger. Um, so we're at 475. So we can go up to. So we could go all direwolves if we wanted to. I'd have to buy what three more. Do I have the money for three more direwolves? Why am I scrolling this way? Dire wolves are towards the beginning of the alphabet. Yes, one, two, three. All right. Mechman. You get a dire wolf. You get a dire wolf. Everybody gets a dire wolf. All right. Let's see what do I want to do with mine. Let's take a look at the loadout. Um, Omnipod. Do we have everything? I have everything unlocked. So, we've got a, two UACs there. I do like the UAC 5s. It's not terrible. And, Jesus, a boatload of other lasers we could. All right. We could go with some AMS. This one seems... Uh, those large pulses will probably do some work, and the streaks will do as well, um, but this one is a little underwhelming to me. I don't hate this, though. We might have to come back, although... Three tons of AMS ammo is a lot of ammo. Uh, LB-10X, two UX, that's not too bad. Um, LB-20X, couple machine guns, eh. Yeah. Yeah. Um... Two Ultra AC5s, LRM, Gauss with the streaks. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Let me let me figure out what I want to do. Um, whoops. There we go. That's what I meant to click. This is what? AMS.
All right, you can see here the direwolf daka. Uh, two uak twos on each side, so a total of four, along with two uak fives and five, eight, and five and eight er mediums. Uh, I've added a little extra ammo. I've added a double heat sink, and I added a little bit of armor um, to the arms as well. So we will see. That looks cool. Um, let's, in fact, let's let's just kind of let's go. Um, Back out of that. Yeah, that might be that might be the thumbnail if I don't already have one. <laughs> okay, I'm really happy with that. I think that looks badass. All right, what are we gonna do for Samantha though? Are we just gonna leave her the normal one? I, I think I'm just gonna leave these two normal. I think I'm just gonna go ultra. Uh, unless I want some of the AMS. Um, you have that one. Naomi should probably have something with more missiles. Let's go ahead and see if we can come up. I don't think there's... There's not a lot of missile-y ones were, were there. Omnipod layout. Um, got the two SRMs. I mean, I guess we could go that for her. Um, that's got a couple SRM4s. It does have an LRM20 with a UAC20. I just don't know that she should take advantage of it. But with a UAC20, a large laser, and a gauss... You know, in theory, it gives her some long range. I just don't know that she'd use it. That's that's all I'm saying. Um, yeah, there's not. And we could pick, let me let me play with this one, and let me see if I can build something else here.
All right, Naomi and Yuichi are gonna run what I have called the Lerm laser. So we've got two LRM-10s with Artemis up there on the shoulder. We've got AMS on the other side. Uh, we do have a boatload of AMS ammo, but these fights may last long. So you know what, I decided to go with it because I didn't really have, other than maybe putting taking 110 out and putting some armor in, I didn't really know what else I was gonna do. I did put some extra armor in the head because I had one slot. Um, I've also put a couple tons in here. It could have easily have gone for a um, double heat sink, but I don't have any slots left. And we were to end up a little bit under tonnage, so I just said hell with it, and that's what we ran. I do have four medium pulse lasers there, three large pulse lasers here. Uh, it is going to generate some heat. It is. We'll just have to see how she does. Um, but slots are, are an issue less than weight, so it didn't make much sense to go with like uh, just a regular ER large or ER mediums, because um, I just didn't have the slots for it. So, uh, this will do what it will do. Whoops. Um, yeah, I didn't make any changes, I don't believe. Oh. I lied. I did make changes. Let's go edit loadout. There we go. Let's come down here to the Lerm laser. Let's go apply loadout, confirm. Now let's go save. There we go. All right, so they are in the Lerm laser. I am in the DACA. Ezra is in the standard with Gauss Rifle, three Pulse. I'm not sure I love that one either, though. Um, actually, Samantha's in the standard. LRM, some Larges, some Pulses, two Auto Cannons. That one seems like it's pretty reasonable. Um, maybe that's what we should run you in as well, but I like the AMS. So even though I'm not sure this is a super useful one, I mean, I guess I could go with this one. I, I think I am. I honestly think... This build is better than this one. Um, the Gauss is nice, but again, I haven't got a lot of damage out of it. So let's go ahead. We're going to edit. We're going to go um, Omnipod load it. Now, I think mine, the DACA, is the best, but the AEI I don't think uses the UX very well. Um, they just won't lean on them. They just shoot them once, and then they wait, and then they shoot them once. Um, yeah, we need to... There we go. All right, I'm going to save real quick. See, that was the uh, where we were starting today. Um, so we're going to go new save. And we're going to say uh, updated mechs for defense. Of There we go. All right. Should we, should we see what the mission is then? Have, have we got that far? Let me turn me off. I trust everyone is as battle ready as possible. Because this battle is ready for us. We are tracking forces from the Novacat's Delta Galaxy. They are marching deep into Waseda Hills to reach the Imperial City. We would not be fighting to defend the Combine under normal circumstances, but these are not normal circumstances. If this world falls, the Combine would likely collapse, giving Smoke Jaguar and Novacat a fast track straight to the Terran Corridor. We cannot allow that to happen. Any signs of Smoke Jaguar? Negative. Last movement report had them break off south along the Kataguchi River. So it is unlikely that you will have to square off against your old comrades. What is the game plan then? To stop the Nova Cats advance cold. The Kelhounds and Dragoons will funnel the cats into this narrow valley, which we will use as a kill box. Us Black Widows are to hold the cats in this position to make them easy targets for Dragoon aerospace bombers who will bomb anyone in the kill box. We will need to hold the line and prevent any Nova Cats from breaking through. Mech Warrior Jaden, Sergeant Middleton will join your star to give you a full compliment. She is as seasoned a warrior as they come. We gratefully accept the help, Sergeant. It is my duty. Your star will be dropped on the outskirts of a small township in the Waseda Hills. Two of the Kelhound mercenary regiments are already in the field and will provide support. Our intelligence agents tell us they are expecting to find weak militia resistance, not a large mercenary force. So hopefully, that will throw them off guard. Either way, their path to victory passes through the Imperial City. Let's instead make it a road to oblivion.
So my biggest worry here is going to be ammo. There's a reason why I went fairly heavy on the lasers um, on this. And uh, and yeah, that's why. So let's go ahead and confirm. And I think we... Oh, I need to do some paint ski here. Um, let's fix that. We make them all... Um, yeah, why not? Let's go... Um, Q is modify. Edit camo. Um... There we go. Black Widow Battalion. Apply to all. Confirm. Back up, back up, back up. And let's drop. Karoguchi Valley, Luthien. Pesh Military District, the Draconis Combine. This is it. We are about to stand against the children of Kerensky. There is no going back. After all we went through, I have no doubts. I am ready. I fought Nova Cats while you kids were still learning to walk. This is nothing new to me. To be defending the Combine once more. Never in my wildest dreams would I think I would be here defending the Kuritan throne. We are ready to advance into the AO, Colonel Wolf. I marked your position on the line, Dragoons. Move to it and hold fast. Air assets so, are still mobilizing. Initially, anyway, we'll be okay. We do have some ammo back there. Let Colonel Wolf know that we appreciate having access to the Dragoon stockpile of Omnimex and clan grade equipment. Don't mention it. The Widows need all of you fighting at your best. Colonel Wolf strongly believes that the best way to do that is behind the controls of mechs your star is familiar with handling. Also, the research your star funded and stored in your codices have been very helpful in upgrading our own stockpiles of clan-grade technology up to the latest standards. So, the least we could do is match a similar level of affordances that the Jaguars offered you. Still, if it's all the same to you, we've appreciated your efforts. Look at you, Star Commander. Speaking like a freeborn. We might make a halfway decent mercenary out of you yet. Fines. Jane, I know you Jaguars like to get scrappy, but resist the urge to stray from your post. Colonel Wolf, one of our mech's key advantages is fighting at speed. If we are not allowed to leverage that, we give the advantage to the Novacats. Not all my men have access to advanced clan tech. You need to work as a team and support one another to make up the difference. Also, with that kill zone pre-spotted for both artillery and airstrikes, you do not want to venture into it. We will not halt fire if you do. Stick to the plan until ordered to do otherwise. Got it? Ah, Colonel Wolf. Seismic sensors detect movement through the valley. Looks like an advanced scout star. They're trying to get a head count. We need to take them out before they get a good read. Agreed. Engage at will. Roger. Time to show them what we can do. Hi! For the combine! Target. For all the inner sphere. Target. Artillery team is ready. Clear the kill zone. A lot of damage just setting people up. New target. Bombers inbound. Hold those cats right where they are. Oops, 
I don't think I have any of that. Oops. Ground forces be advised. Shalones are starting their attack run. Clear the kill zone immediately. It's about time. Got a couple of them. There we go. Good, good, good. Man, I took a lot of damage already. Let somebody else shoot at him. Get his uh, get his attention first. Bunch of cats roasting out here. Uh, scopes say even more are coming though. Finding their visions in the flames must have baked their brains. You think if we pile enough of them up on the battlefield, some vision of defeat will deter them? They will keep staring into the fire until they see the outcome they want. If the Novacat warriors believe this battle to be part of some vision, few can stand in the way of them accomplishing their grand design. What if their vision is wrong? Then they die. Often by taking stupid risks like proper lunatics. They can be crazier than a Goliath scorpion hopped up on Necrosia when acting on a vision. Have we proven ourselves worthy of your Crazier than a spider monkey so I'm out to do, though? So far. I am surprised the dragoons would fight to defend the combined world. We have no love for the DCMS and their scheming warlords, or Takashi Kirita. But we also know better than anyone in the inner sphere what the children of Kerensky are truly capable of. If the Great Houses are to survive their wrath, we either stand together in unity or face subjugation at the hands of the Crusaders. Novacat Union just set down. Expect more hostiles soon. They're really trying to brute force their way through here. If they break through this position, they'll have a clear shot at the Imperial City. We cannot allow that to happen. All right, what type of range do I got? 630, 810. Really about 600 is where I want to be, it looks like. I'm going to stay back a little bit. Because I'm getting the shit kicked out of me, though I haven't shot anybody. You'd think they'd be going after people that were shooting them, not after me. But, you know, whatever. Target. Destroyed a mech. Roll forward here a little bit. I went over just a bit. Oh, give me gun. guns back. Come back. Everybody? Nope. Weapons online. We step up here. Target. New 
Colonel. Cats have learned their lesson. They're shifting their focus to the Kelly. We lose Samantha already? Holy shit. Jaden, Middleton, we can manage here for the time being. I want your star to head to the Kelhoun front and reinforce their position. Copy that. Repositioning. The cats are all over us. We can't hold out much longer. Colonel Kell is jammed up. Get over there and assist. Roger that. Moving out now. This might not go well if we've already lost one of our four mechs. Shifted away from our front and looked to collapse onto yours. We are here to offer our assistance. How can I say no to assistance from the famed Black Widow Battalion? Gunnar Wolf? What should we be expecting? Nothing good, I'm afraid, Morgan. We took the brunt of the last Novacat push, but a bombing run made them think twice on pushing your position. Scan mode. Disengaged. They fell back to regroup, but I fear they will try to push through your line next. Prudent. My Kelhounds are not blessed with five full regiments like your Dragoons. So the assistance is appreciated. Our scouts are reporting their assault will hit us momentarily. Please, do what you can to support my men. If you can spot for me and my missile carriers, we will try to focus any targets you paid for us. Sending over our transceiver codes now. Come on, oops. Should allow you to get Why am I going the wrong direction? Because I'm an idiot. Don't kill yourself trying to win the battle on your own. If you need to patch yourself up, use this lull to use that base's repair bays. Make sure your machine can hold out through this thing. See, if down. we would have had all of them, we could have got everybody repaired, but I didn't notice. Well, many of our old guard are clanborn, and just because us mercs fight for money doesn't mean that it's all we value. We still fight to make a home of our own and carve a comfortable life within the inner sphere. We just don't resort to bending the knee to play lapdog to nobles who can't look past the vast amount of battle mechs we have at our disposal. Is that not what caused the dragon feud with Takashi? One of his warlords trying to coerce you into DCMS, like the mercs in the ALAG regiments. It was. And not the first time the House Lords have tried. But since Misery, we now have a world to ourselves. On outreach, no one is our master. And in this universe, that kind of freedom is worth fighting for. Well, I don't think Naomi ended up in hers. She's at 98%. We did get all the ammo replaced, replaced though, so she should be okay. Well, until we die. Scan mode engaged. But until then, you know, Scan for the moment. Disengaged. The fact that we're already down one is a little bit concerning for me. your team has already not handled herself. So, yeah. All right. I guess I can turn me on, huh? All right, Dragoons. There is a wall of enemies standing between us and that union. Not for long. We have more of them coming at us.
Okay, that's not too bad. Execution is just soaking it up, though, isn't it? Incoming missile. Weapons online. Target destroyed. Heat critical. What's down, Mech? Eliminated. Target. and we have a straight shot to the dropship. Destroyed. All right. Positive on that. With you, Star Commander. Deploying now. I think our alarms are still fine. Another Not just kill. ours. New target. Target destroyed. New target. That everybody? Who's back over there? Oh. Because I hit him. Affirmative. We are moving in. You have an opening to the dropship. Take it before the cats collapse on you. Tighten up, everyone. Taking out that dropship is going to take everything we have left. The beating it took breaking atmosphere has weakened its armored hull. Our mech's weapons should be able to directly damage it now. It is still a massive structure, able to take some serious punishment. Yes, but it can eventually give way. Lay into it with everything you have. All right, well, let's see if we can do this. We're in reasonable condition at the moment. Disengaged. Well, that's not good. Scan mode engaged. Scan mode engaged. No more ammo anywhere. Now, we probably could have actually backed up. Scan mode disengaged. That ammo down there? Probably not. Another dropship coming in. I get that. Star Commander. 
Throw me some guns. Get to this one. Ah, engaging. Nothing more want. Focusing on your target. There we go, there we go. Attacking on Star Commander's orders. I'm gonna try to rotate us to get that last couple turrets. Unit down. Fire commencing. Oh, they got them all. Dropship is destroyed. No cats left on the field. Oh. Okay. Um, uh, color me surprised. We did really well. <laughs> I was worried about that one. Like I said, it did not go that smoothly last time. And we got into it um, on my own with, with the, the initial build you saw, with the, the lance you saw, um, which was what, about 25 tons under. Um, but yeah, I'll take it. Hey, we got, we got level 15 too. I don't think that does anything for us, but we got it. Um... We got a paint scheme. We got some unread notifications. All right, we got some of that. Let's let's see what else we got going on. So we do have some stuff still going. Um, what else do we have that we might want? ER laser. Do use ERs a lot. Um, duration when it hurt. Flamers, Gauss, heat. Uh, LRM heat. I think that's pretty good. And yeah, that's it. There we go. <laughs> uh, let's see. Chassis milestones. Well, I mean, we, we are doing a lot with the Dire Wolf. All right. So we got our assault mech kills. We got our milestones. We've got our medium mech kills. Uh, we've got our use this chassis. Um, yeah, that's not too bad. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The only thing we don't have is all of our light mech kill. Oh, we've got some vehicle kills we got to get to. Um, yeah, well, I mean, it is what it is. Uh, mech bay. Are we going to be able to get everything repaired? Um, no, not at the moment. Um, 
Can we update our... Our technicians cannot be upgraded anymore. We got five. I mean, I guess we can go three more. So you get one. You get two. Oh, I guess I had enough as it was. Oh, well. Um, assign idle technicians. So, no, we don't. Uh, I mean, I guess we could buy another dire wolf, so we have an extra one to swap in and out. We've got the money. Uh, let's go battle mechs, uh, dire wolf, purchase, um, mech bay. We'll toss that one in, and this was which? Uh, ultra, four large, four medium. You know what we're going to do? We're going to make this one. Uh, edit Omnipod. Let's go with the DACA. Oh, I put the wrong mech in. Direwolf. There we go. Uh, edit. Help if I hit the right button. R. Direwolf Daka. Is that what I'm going to go with, or do I just keep doing this one? You know what? I'm just going to do this one. I think they did well with this one. I like seeing the LRMs fly. There we go. We did fine. We are at level max. That's it, apparently. Uh, Mission Central. What do we got next? Uh, do we do we read all these? Yeah. Um... I think we've been going long enough, so our next mission is a world on fire. A defense, 500 tons. We'll be back for it next time. Thanks for watching, guys. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Don't forget to subscribe. We'll see you next time. Cheers.